Welcome to my YouTube channel Auto Vehicle Info, and on to today's video, we explore the legendary SR-71 Blackbird A but not as just a Cold War relic. In 2025, this iconic aircraft is back in the spotlight thanks to renewed interest in hypersonic reconnaissance and the evolution of aerial surveillance. While the original SR-71 retired in the late 1990s, the spirit of this aircraft lives on, and new developments have brought the Blackbird concept roaring into the 21st century. Originally developed in the 1960s by Lockheed's famous Skunk Works division, the SR-71 Blackbird was a marvel of engineering. It was capable of flying over three times the speed of sound A above Mach 3A and could cruise at altitudes over 85,000 feet. This allowed it to outrun missiles and avoid threats simply by flying higher and faster than anything else. It served as a reconnaissance aircraft capturing higher resolution imagery of enemy territory during missions that were often too dangerous for satellites or slower aircraft. But by 1998, the aircraft was officially retired due to the high operational cost, maintenance challenges, and the emergence of more cost-effective surveillance technologies like drones and satellites. However, those alternatives have limitations especially when it comes to real-time intelligence gathering and rapid response in contested airspace. Fast forward to 2025, and the Blackbird's unique advantages are more relevant than ever. Over the past decade, there has been increasing global competition in hypersonic weapons, next-gen surveillance, and high-speed aircraft. This has led to the development of aircraft inspired by the SR-71's legacy. While the original airframes are no longer flying, what we now see is a reimagined, advanced platform A often referred to as the SR-72, or what many are calling the son of Blackbird. The 2025 version of this aircraft is designed to go beyond reconnaissance. It's built to be optionally unmanned meaning it can be flown with the pilot or autonomously. It also incorporates hypersonic propulsion technologies that allow it to exceed Mach 5, far faster than the original SR-71. This speed is critical for penetrating denied airspace, gathering intelligence, and even delivering precision strikes if needed all before enemy defenses can react. This new generation Blackbird is expected to use a turbine-based combined cycle engine. This means it takes off and climbs like a regular jet, but once it hits high speed and altitude, it transitions to a scramjet A, a supersonic combustion ramjet A that allows it to reach hypersonic velocities. This is a massive leap from the J-58 turbojets that powered the original SR-71. One of the major design improvements is its use of modern materials. The 1960s Blackburn was made mostly from titanium to survive the heat generated at high speeds. In 2025, the updated version uses advanced composite materials, ceramic coatings, and carbon-carbon structures to better manage thermal stress and reduce radar visibility. It's faster, stealthier, and more durable than ever before. Even though much of the SR-72 program is classified, leaked information and military contracts suggest the aircraft has been tested in secret for years and may already be operational in a limited capacity. It's designed to support both intelligence and strategic deterrence missions. With the rise of near-peer threats and growing global tensions, the U.S. needs something that can get in and out of high-risk zones instantly a something satellites can't do on command and drones can't do without being detected or shot down. The 2025 version also comes equipped with modern sensor suites. We're talking about real-time data links, higher-resolution optical and infrared cameras, and radar systems that can map terrain and moving targets even at extreme speeds. The idea is to gather, process, and transmit intelligence while still in flight, giving commanders instant situational awareness. This capability is vital for time-sensitive missions, such as locating mobile missile launchers or tracking strategic enemy movements. Interestingly, the role of the new Blackbird may not be limited to reconnaissance. With the introduction of precision hypersonic weapons, the aircraft could potentially carry a payload. The idea is not to create a bomber but to allow the Blackbird to strike key targets such as enemy radar stations, communication hubs, or launch platforms, and then disappear at speeds unmatched by any known interceptor. On the technology front, 
AI plays a big role. Autopilot systems are no longer just about keeping the plane level. They're now capable of mission planning, threat avoidance, and adaptive routing in real time. This level of autonomy allows the aircraft to operate in extremely hostile environments without constant input from ground operators or pilots. For optionally manned versions, this reduces pilot workload and enhances safety. Another interesting aspect is the aircraft's data sharing capabilities. Using secure, high bandwidth communication systems, it can feed intel to satellites, AWA explains, ground forces, and even naval fleets in real time. This means the aircraft doesn't just operate alone, it becomes a vital part of a larger combat or reconnaissance network, increasing its value in joint operations. Of course, the rebirth of the Blackbird isn't just about raw speed. It represents a shift in how we think about air dominance and intelligence superiority. In an age where adversaries are deploying anti-satellite weapons and cyber attacks are common, having a platform that can physically enter airspace, gather first-hand intel, and return safely is more critical than ever. While the Air Force has not officially confirmed all the details of the 2025 version, the defense community widely agrees that such a platform exists and has likely already been tested in real-world conditions. Its presence acts as both a strategic deterrent and a technological benchmark for hypersonic aviation. The legacy of the original SR-71 Blackbird laid the foundation. That aircraft broke every speed and altitude record flying missions that no other jet could handle. The 2025 version takes that spirit and merges it with next-gen technology A artificial intelligence, advanced materials, hypersonic propulsion, and multi-role capabilities. It's not just about being the fastest. It's about being untouchable, untraceable, and incredibly smart. Whether it's surveilling a nuclear site, tracking a high-value target, or providing early warning in a global crisis, this modern blackbird is designed to do it all a silently, swiftly, and with unmatched precision. So that's the story of the 2025 SR-71 Blackbird A or what it has evolved into. A legendary name reborn for a new era of global challenges and cutting-edge defense. If you're as fascinated by aerospace innovation and high-speed aviation as we are, make sure to subscribe to Auto Vehicle Info, leave a comment with your thoughts and hit the bell so you never miss our deep dives into the most powerful vehicles ever created. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.